वेलकम टू ट्यूटोरियल सीरीज ऑन माइक्रोकंट्रोलर पेरिफेरल इंटरफेसिंग हाय आई एम एलिसाई रौनक सुरेंशी आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन एलसीडी इंटरफेसिंग विथ एट जीरो फाइव वन सो लेट्स मूव टूवर्ड्स द पॉइंट सो वॉट इज एल सी डी बेसिकली एल सी डी इज ए लिक्विड क्रिस्टल डिस्प्ले कंसिस्ट ऑफ अ थीन लेयर अबाउट टेन माइक्रोमीटर ऑफ अ लिक्विड क्रिस्टल सैंडविच बिट्वीन two glasses with transparent electrode placed on their inside faces the main principle behind the liquid crystal molecules is that when an electric current is applied to them they may tend to untwist this causes change in light angle passing through them so light is allowed to pass through particular area of lcd and only only that area becomes a darker comparing to others so one question arises in your mind why lcd interfacing with 8051 why not others like seven segment oled and others why we found lcd interfacing at maximum places so simple reason is that they are low power economical and and an overcome over seven segment display is they can show a custom characters also along with wide range of application they are programmable programmable and animation is possible also so so for interfacing lcd with 8051 we required 8051 microcontroller reset circuit crystal circuit that is external circuit 16 cross 2 lcd display lcd interfacing is can be 8 bit and 4 bit we can use 8 bit or 4 bit in a system in 8 bits 8 pins as data are connected whole data sends at only once in 4 bit 4 pins are connected as a data pins for sending data for sending the data first we will send four bit of four bit of data that is one nibble and then next nibble which is the data in sends in the format of upper and lower nibbles so first circuit is 8051 8051 is a microcontroller in which no default library is interfacing with for lcd display so it will be better to interfacing lcd so that we can also know how to develop our own library in 8051 schematic xtal1 and xtal2 from a crystal ea pin is of 8051 is connected to plus vcc that is power supply so that we can read internal memory of controller only port 1 is connected to lcd data is with data will be arrived at port 1 the pins rs rw and en are connected to p2.0 p2.1 and p2.2 next is xtal circuit and reset circuit 11.0592 megahertz crystal is connected with two capacitors of value 33 picofarad the values of capacitor is selected typically from data sheet so you can refer the data sheet in reset circuit the push button is connected for reset the button is connected between reset pin and controller reset pin of controller and 5 volt supply the 10k resistance is mainly connected with capacitor for maintaining the rc time constant which will be helpful for resetting microcontroller for particular duration next is 16 cross 2 lcd 16 cross l cross 2 lcd have two rows only 
A and K are connected for background light in LED. The brightness adjusted, adjusted using potentiometer connected between ground plus VCC and VEEP. RS, RW, EN are control pins to access the different register, either select register or write register. So next is pin description. In pin description, plus VSS pin is for ground. Similarly, plus VCC pin is for 5 volt supply. VEE is for 5 volt supply, which will be useful for adjusting the contrast of LCD. RS pin we can give at input as RS pin equal to 0 for selecting command register and RS equal to 1 for selecting data register. RW is a write read pin. RW equal to 0 means we can perform write operation. When RW equal to 1, we can perform read operation from LCD. EN is for enabling the LCD. DB0 to DB7 pins are the 8-bit data pin on which we can send the data from microcontroller. Next is LCD commands. As LCD is programmable, some commands are required for setting the LCD display. So we use the LCD commands. LCD commands are given through the software. When LCD command in hex is equal to 1, it will clear the display screen. When LCD command in hex is equal to 2, it will return to home. Similarly, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 gives the shift cursor to left, right, shift display, right, shift display, left. Similarly, some more commands. Hex command E is for display on and cursor on. Hex command F is for display off and cursor is blinking. Similarly, we can force the cursor at beginning by hex code 0x80 and 0x0 for second line. So cursor will be came at first line of first row. And Due to C0, the cursor will came at first line, first uh, at first position for second row. So next, writing the program. As 8051 is not having inbuilt LCD library file, we will develop LCD library file. For 8-bit interfacing, we require lcd.h that is header file for lcd, lcd.c is initializing the lcd, putcar.c printing single character on lcd, main.c that is our main program. So first is lcd.h. In lcd.h, we declared only s-bit and some functions. S-bit is declared some as bit and functions s bit is data type which reserves only one bit void wrcmd is a function for writing the command void delay ms is for delay function lcd in it for initializing the lcd so now we will see lcd.c the function definition declared in lcd.h in lcd.c we will look the function wrcmd that is write command in write command the sequence rs is equal to 0 rw is equal to 0 en equal to 0 and then character c en equal to 1 en equal to 0 e is given a typical with a typical sequence so that it will write character C to command register. 
LCD equal to C and then EN equal to 1 gives right that is the writes command register with C. The RS, RW and EN equal to 0 before LCD equal to C means they are connecting to 0 so that they becomes perfectly 0 before writing to command register as C. After writing uh, after writing C we can uh, we enable EN equal to 1 and we disable EN equal to 0. Some execution time is needed to needed for this sequence so we gave a delay ms equal to 2. Void delay ms unsigned carry n is a delay function for n milliseconds. The loop 167 into 2 for 1 millisecond. The, the n is the n is used for generating n millisecond delay. So the loop is continuously evolves in only one in this bracket. Next function, next function is LCD init. So RS, RS, RW, EN equal to zero means initially we are forcing them to zero and then we give some more commands. Delay MS 15, write command to 38 that is we are selecting both the rows then delay ms 5 second 5 millisecond it will be wait for 5 millisecond wrcmd 0x0f means we gave command we gave 0x0f to command register so it will be display on it will be display on and cursor is blinking at certain position 0x06 for increment cursor and 0x80 for bringing cursor to the first line 0x08 0x80 is used for displaying our da data at particular position that is 80 first line first position so we are forcing cursor at begin and incrementing cursor selecting lines these are also other commands so next function is our put care function put care function is used to display a single character just like when we use printf it will be display full string the put care function is used for printing the single character so in put care function we sends a character c so it will be received as unsigned character c rs equal to 1 rw equal to 0 en, en equal to 0 selects selects the register and lcd equal to c writes the data on screen and then we enabling and disabling the enable signal for writing on screen so next is our main program in main program we simply initialize the lcd.init we will see what is written in lcd.init we already seen that so in lcd lcd.init LCD we return initializing code that is commands and enable equal to 0 rs equal to 0 rw equal to 0 so it will initialize the lcd we can change the name of function also and then we writing in first row hello and second writing printf i am rona in second so and the while one is for continuous loop so it will be display and remains in a continuous loop now we will see the proteus simulation As I already explained, port 1 is for connection with LCD. RS, 
RW and EN pins are connected to P2.0, P2.1 and P2.2 which are connected with the RS, RW, EN pin with LCD. The sketching external circuit that is crystal circuit and reset circuit in Proteus is not mandatory so we can avoid. Along with this to avoid the wiring confusion we use the label for wires so we can use the label from here the label option by double clicking microcontroller we can modify or edit the component so we can change the name value package or file program the the project file the project hex file is created from microvision kyle is inserted or burn in virtual microcontroller so let's burn the file and run the simulation okay so it's displaying wow hi i am rona Thanks for watching.